All right, here it is, May the 8th, about 11 o'clock at night. And uh, I just unwrapped some of my Ozark Gold uh, grass on this little tree, this little apple tree. You can see this little cleft graft here is healing up nicely. All that yellowish white look you see is the uh, scar tissue where it's healed up. It's growing back together. I've got a slight little crack here. This was a uh, cleft graft and it didn't go all the way across. Now it'll probably heal up, but I'll probably put something on there to seal that for a little bit longer. This is another cleft graft. No, let me see. Take that back. This looks like it was a Z graft. And it's healing up really good. But you can see there's a line here. Let me see. Well, at night out here, it's hard to see. You see there's a couple different, uh, let me see. Well, I can't, I can't find my own finger in here. Okay, so it goes boom. And it comes back here and goes back. So anyways, that one is healing up very nicely. All that white uh, scar tissue where it's growed together. This graft has taken quite nicely. Another year, you won't even hardly be able to tell where that is. That's a good straight union there. And, and actually, this one's pretty good too. And uh, this one here, I'm going to have to look back at my old videos and make sure what type of graft I did on these. I can't hardly see the The unions, but this might have been a a Z graft also. I have to look back and see, but you can tell. Let me zoom back out. They're leafing out nicely, doing real well. Now this one here is the same variety, and it's still alive, but it hasn't really flushed out or anything yet. I'm not sure if it's going to make it. But I'm just going to leave it wrapped up for right now. I'm not even going to look in there. So that's my Ozark gold on this. Uh, I call it Fuji slash Gala because I don't remember which variety this little the mother the little tree is here that I put these on. But needless to say, the three graphs here, here, and here are doing real well. I made a video of it, day, but I'll go ahead and show it while I'm here of my honey gold. There's a double cleft graft here that has taken really well. And there's a uh, single cleft graft here doing really well. And a double rind graft here. That's here healing up and, and doing really good. So. And I might as well run on over here to my yeah, it's like 11 o'clock at night. This is the only time I get to come out here and work on stuff. It's been storming and raining today. Tornado weather. But I showed this here a while back. My Arkansas Blacks. This set, I'm not sure if they're going to make it. They did heal up pretty good, but they're not budding out. These here, this is a double cleft graft. They've, they're doing really well. A uh, single rind graft here doing really well. Uh, and then going to my Braeburn apples. This is a, a double cleft graft that's uh, doing really well. And here's a double cleft graft that one of them, one of the pieces is doing well. The other one's still alive, but it's not, I'll probably take it off anyways. So, just a little update on my apple grafts uh, and this is a uh, molly's delicious apple that these are grafted onto and she's got a few apples here and there on her this year i wasn't sure she would because i had 
uh, trimmed her back so far. There's your one right there. And uh, so these here are Gala apples. Uh, they're a little newer. I have one that's really doing well, but I'm not going to unwrap them yet. And my Jersey Max, I'm not unwrapping them yet, but they're uh, they're budding out, starting to to come on out. So even this one here is starting to show a little green. So uh, really proud of the of the graph so far on my apple trees. It's my first year doing this, and I think the I didn't really expect even maybe half of them. I thought if I get half of them, I'd be doing okay. So, very pleased with the results so far. I'll show you another Molly's Delicious Apple. Here you go. Ain't that pretty? Y'all have a good evening. Good night, whatever you want to call it. <laughs>